I'm Tara Bliss, and I've been here at CareNet since I found out I was pregnant. I took my pregnancy test here with Ashley, and I've been here ever since. I'm Hannah, I'm 20, and this is Benjamin, and he is two weeks old. Um, my name is Courtney, and I'm 22 years old, and I'm about eight and a half months pregnant. Okay. Hi, my name is Jackie. I'm 21 years old. And this is Carter. He's two months. It was really welcoming um, because I was, of course, freaked out. Um, it was not a planned thing, unplanned blessing, I guess. Um, and so it was really nice to have somebody not really judge. I was, I was scared, definitely, but um, I, was, I was very comfortable here, and I'm glad I came here to get it done. Everybody was just very welcoming and very warm, and and, uh, and I learned a lot in the first meeting, so. Great. Oh gosh, um, I got a baby bathtub, which comes in handy. Diapers, those are definitely a big thing. Um, bassinet sheets, I couldn't find them anywhere, so I got like five from here. Um, and burp rags, bibs. Ah. Anything that I could possibly need, you guys have. It's nice. I have gotten a high chair, a lots of diapers, um, clothes, uh, a curb set. Oh, we've gotten tons of stuff. <laughs> um, this hat, actually, that Benjamin's yeah. modeling for us today, we got from CareNet. Um, we got diapers, newborn diapers, because surprisingly, no one thinks of that at baby showers. <laughs> and um, we got the crib here. Um, and that's been great, actually, fantastic, because um, it fits, you know, well with everything. And we've got bedding, we've gotten receiving blankets, bath stuff. Um, literally everything Benjamin has needed up to this point has come from CareNet. Oh, great. <laughs> so, you guys have been fantastic. Great. Um, I've learned a ton through CareNet um, about safety, keeping your household safe when you have a baby about um, just taking care of a baby in general and their well-being and making sure that they know that you love them and just making a good home environment for them. I learned on different calming techniques for to soothe him and just different stress relief techniques to help myself as far as when I get overwhelmed what I can do. Um, I would definitely say that um, through the Earn While You Learn program um, and through CareNet and with the help of people like Tammy here at CareNet, I um, rededicated my life to Christ. <laughs> uh, the staff here, they make you feel extremely welcomed and that what you're going through is an okay thing and that there is help for you out there. Definitely the people. Everyone's really nice, really helpful, really considerate, and they don't just care that you're coming, you know, they actually want to know how you're feeling and what's going on and how you're doing, and they, they actually talk to me a lot and just help me through everything. The people are great. I think um, everybody is extremely welcoming and very, very kind-hearted and very loving and, like, very passionate about what they do, so... I've really enjoyed um, developing friendships with them. So it's been a big emotional support for me with overcoming a lot from my past and getting through that. It's been somebody that I can talk to and know that what I'm going through, other people have gone through it and that, you know, I can get through it and I'll be okay. Yes, definitely. Absolutely. Oh yes, definitely. Um, I've already recommended it to a couple people and I just, I can't say enough about how great it is here. Yes, I would because it is, if it's, especially if it's your first pregnancy, it is so educational and helps you understand what you're going through and why certain things are the way they are and makes you know that, you know, it's normal. To experience a lot of your feelings and to know that there's this kind of help out there is just a very comforting feeling. Absolutely, without question. Um, and particularly anyone who is in the way of thinking that abortion is 
you know, a viable option um, because I can tell you that it's it seems like like it's the world's solution, you know, because it, it's easy to just shift that responsibility and say, oh well, you know, it's just a fetus. But when you come in and you see the little footprint pin and you see how big it is at eight weeks and everything else, and you start to kind of get that this is a real person, mm -hmm. you know, a small person, not quite sentient yet, but a person nonetheless. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah, I definitely would recommend that for anyone who's struggling with a decision. Um, because there's no judgment here and people have just been really accepting and helpful. Hi everyone, my name is Teresa Reed and I'm the Director of Client Services here at CareNet. I'm so excited that we have such a great turnout this year and we're so thankful for every single one of you. Um, this year we've had the joy of opening the doors of CareNet over 550 times. And it seems like the Lord is um, deepening the level of support that we're able to give our women. Um, we have started a lot more like relationship counseling and that kind of thing. And in that vein, we actually have recently purchased um, a series of specially made videos, uh, classes for, from the American Association of Christian Counselors so that we can deepen our um, training for our volunteers and staff in what we can do for our women here. Um, we are extremely excited about that. It's going to be starting um, in January, our classes. And if you have any interest in participating in those classes or, or even a little tug about possibly being a volunteer here at CareNet, we would really appreciate it if you would um, Find the little white card on your table and just jot down your name and phone number and um, we'll get in touch with you. So we're so thankful you're here and we're so thankful for what the Lord is doing here at CareNet. Thank you. To the one whose dreams have fallen all apart And all you're left with is a tired and broken I can tell by your eyes you think you're on your own, but you're not alone. Have you heard of the one who can calm the raging sea? Give sight to the blind, pull the lame up to their feet. With a love so strong, and never let you go.